Hustler case and a cousin title. I love you. I love you. Yeah. I love you. Hmm. Life ain't gonna be what it ain't gonna be. Second and 11. Up top. Man, wide open. Touchdown. Western Kentucky. Reed. Straight drop. Right side. And all alone. Plenty of room down to the 30, now the 29-yard line. Very important to Helton's offense. First and 10 from the 11, left side. Malachi Corley's got some room, up the gut, spins in, loses the helmet. At least one does, but the touchdown from Corley. Ashland, Alabama. Second and 10, Reed. Straight drop, middle. And for the third time this afternoon, Malachi Corley with the touchdown. This one from 25 yards out and third and seven. Reed, straight drop. Looking deep. What a catch and a touchdown. Daywood Davis. He won a national championship in 2019. He is looking to throw and he has all kinds of time and has a man open. It is caught to midfield. Fake handoff. Reed completes it to Dalvin Smith. And he crosses the goal line. And I've watched all of their tape last week, but how about this play? Ends up being a flea flicker. Reed down the sideline. It's caught, and this is going to be a big gainer for Western Kentucky. In fact, it's going to be a touchdown. Defensive. Sir, third interception for Shager. Fourth for Hawaii quarterbacks. Reed looking end zone. And in college football, you could argue with some of the success that they've had. And time to throw and connects with his tight end. It is a touchdown, Joey Belgium. Put the ball in traffic, put it in harm's way. Hasn't done it yet today. And five different receivers, a wide open man dropped it in the bread basket for Daywood Davis and his second touchdown of the year. Reed calls his own number and he's in for the touchdown. Occurrence. Quick shot. Left side. There's Malachi Corley. First guy misses. Second guy misses. Across the 50. Flag in the play. He's free. Bye bye. Malachi Corley. Off to the races. As I said before the break, 94 yards and a cloud of dust. Second and nine. Final play of the first quarter. Naked backfield. Reed got a man. Touchdown. Western Kentucky. Third and 13 now. From the 20. Reed. Little pump, Malachi Corley, back in the end zone, perfect catch. Referee looking for their possession, touchdown. Reed, plenty of time, he's got all day. Look at the blocking, cross the middle, and caught. Dalvin Smith, I mean, it's just unfair right now. You break the first tackle, extra yards. Reed, little pump, now gonna go deep. Davis on the grab. Quick motion. Reed rolling right. He's got plenty of time. Fires. And touchdown. For his shoulder, he's got it. Talk about throwing the football where the defender cannot get to. Reed has time again. Simon in the corner. Touchdown, Hilltoppers. A flying start for Western Kentucky. His foot in the ground, gets down the sideline. Malthus in with a burst, and he's in for a topper's touchdown. So when you need to dial up the quick strike offense, you're able to do it if you're Western Kentucky. Daywood Davis on fourth down from nine yards out, his 11th catch, and he pulls the Hilltoppers within a score. Back with the quarterback draw. Keeps it. Waiting for the indication right now, he is short. But you get a feeling the way that this line has moved that football, and it is a touchdown. Austin Reed is in. Match touchdowns with touchdowns. Stays on his feet. Malachi Corley, the sophomore, down the sideline. Cuts it back in, and he'll take it into the red zone. A little finders receiver out wide, looking for speed, looking for that breakaway up to midfield as again, 
Success. Davis ranks 15th in the SBA, FBS in yards per catch. Lobs one in, drops it in to Davis. That's pretty right there. Has show, but wants more, has more. Touchdown, Hilltoppers. Michael Mathis. The equitation world champion at the time now. That's amazing. And how did you get onto the name Mr. True Blue? I know it has something to do with the Miss Amanda right next. For Bell Jam. Reed going to keep it himself. And he will break the plane. And that, Bell Jan in motion. Play action. Reed. Touchdown. Runs to pick up that first down. Eight yard pickup, and they're already moving. We go with a bubble screen here, complete to David Davis, and he makes a big play, picks up the first down as he put quarter. Well, you know, <laughs> as we get to a run up the middle here, are they going to stop him? No. Who would have thought Austin Reed would have taken it in for the touchdown himself? Reed. Fires, pass complete to Corley, finds some room, gets across the 35, finally brought down as he gets across the... And they'll go with the sneak, push forward, and Western Kentucky takes the lead. After 13 unanswered points scored by Western Kentucky, and they have the football here with a three-point lead, a pass complete to Malachi Corley. Reed. Time. Rolls to his right. Sets up. He's going to throw deep down the field. And that is caught. Jalen Hall. Play action read with time to the end zone. That's caught. Touchdown, Hilltoppers. For, what, for Western Kentucky this season. Reed pumps, tosses in zone. Touchdown. Davis has it. Daywood Davis with a touchdown. Good job so far. Reed on second down. Check it down again. Corley breaking free. Corley high steps his way across the 50. There goes Corley inside the 10. He will take it all the way. Corley touchdown Western Kentucky again. Reed on third and nine. Zips it complete inside the 10. Stretching, fighting, reaching. And in for a touchdown is Josh Simon. It was three touchdown passes on the first three drives for Western Kentucky. Hall slips as he goes in motion. Fling it to the outside. Corley on the screen. Corley, who is dominated in the first half, breaking tackles again. Corley takes it inside the 10. Defense against pressure? What Charlotte's offense should be doing against Western Kentucky's pressure? Running screen plays. 42 yards on the screen for Corley. He has over 150 yards of total offense, setting up TD pass number five. Confidence, and the way to do that is to cause a turnover. Let's see if they can do it on this drive. Corley again on the screen. Corley breaking free again. Corley goes rolling inside the 20-yard line. This is what West Kentucky is doing offensively. They're going to continue to beat you down the field. Flag down, free play, end zone incomplete. Matheson looked like a free play. Looked like he caught that. Offside, defense number one in the neutral zone at the snap. Penalties declined, resulted to play as a touchdown. Matheson hangs on. Reed looks to throw. He's going to take a shot in the end zone. It is. Is it caught? It is. What a start. Four out of five on third down. Reed is going to zip one over the middle. He's got Davis, slips a tackle. Davis still going, and he's going to streak all the way in the end zone. Taywood Davis. Reed on third and five. Throws on the sideline. Catch made by Hall. Back shoulder throw. Called for a first down. Reed is going to take another shot. He's got Matheson. Catches it, breaks a tackle. He's got under 10 seconds. He's finally stopped at the seven. Check center running back. Reed over the middle, and it's caught by Corley. Stays on his feet after taking the shot, and he's finally stopped inside the 35. All lined up at the top of your screen. He's in motion, and it'll be a quarterback run for Reed, and he plows his way. Is he in? No signal yet. He's in. 
touchdown, Western Kentucky. And Austin Reed, his first rushing touchdown in the afternoon. It's Reed is going to throw. Up for grabs and a catch made by Hall. Give him a hat trick. It's his third touchdown of the game. 42% on third downs this year. Four-man rush going over the middle. Pass is caught inside the 40 down to the 32 by Jalen Hall. DJ James. Reed. Lofts it in the air and it's caught. It fluttered through the air right until Michael Matheson comes down with it. Comes in motion. Here comes some of that pressure you're talking about. And they do get it to Corley. The first down and a whole lot more as he crosses midfield inside the 40 down. And Reed dodges one defender, goes to the end zone. Touchdown, Western Kentucky. Reed kept it alive with his feet and, and five. Trying to set up a middle screen and it works. Pass is caught there. Simon, touchdown, Western Kentucky. What a play call from Tyson Helton. Hardly even look at the tape. That one complete to the tight end, Joshua Simon down the seam. Simon tough to bring down, finally down in the 35 yard line. Could have got a, a lot of yards after catch, but a first down nonetheless. Well, going to get a lot of yards here. And six, a touchdown, Malachi Corley. He has great vision and ball skills and has really earned the right to start at the safety spot. Now they found the running back, Irvin Poindexter. He's across the 40. These are playing to the receivers. Quick slant, first down and running room for Matheson into Owl territory. Freeing up. His receiver, Michael Matheson, for the slant, for the catch. And now another wide open receiver. It's Corley, touchdown! He has to limit that this second half to give their team an opportunity to win. Reed, wide open man again. Dalvin Smith lost the ball. Oh, and they couldn't save it inbound. Four on fourth downs today. Reed will throw to the end zone. Jalen Hall! Western Kentucky has to answer. Reed rolls out right. Throws it back, shoulder, and caught inside the five by Corley. Lot. Reed's gonna, gonna run, run it. it. Touchdown! And Malachi Corley to run an out route here. Reed rolls right, there throws, is. caught! Hilltoppers win! And their conference title home. Tempo, tempo, tempo from this Western Kentucky team. You hand the ball off on a counterplay, get the first down. Hurry to the line. My goodness, has Austin Reed been sharp on these first two drives, putting the ball right on the money. They're dealing with calls coming in slowly. They're coming, dealing with confusion. They're dealing with incredibly talented receivers on the other side. I mean, Cade Womack had to do it, but you called him out on the first play, and it gives Western Kentucky all the time and encouragement in the world. Jaguar, and it's Jaden Voison who is shaken up. He's just a fantastic bounce. And on an uptime down, Malachi Corley goes into the end zone for the score. All the flow is going. I, I mean, the play before where you convert on the third down, and then the, the danger is that they go tempo in South Alabama. Fortunately uh, for for that record, um, West Kentucky it has the ball a lot, which means a lot of plays. Yeah. So uh, it, it, 